cancers, get in here. Get in here, get in here, because this is what this reading is all about. In June, in love, you can have whatever you want. You have many options coming your way. With this Capricorn energy here, could be an earth sign person that's caught your eye, or just you're not accepting anything less than what you want. Body, yaddy, yaddy, hot girl summer, hardly no clothes on, okay? Many options coming your way. Cancers, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what resonates for you down in the comment section. This is the other end. Cancers, you have many options to choose from in June, okay? And you're going to be able to choose whoever it is that you want, okay, with this Queen of Coins energy. With this King of Coins, Taurus energy here, heavy on the earth sign already, this is setting a foundation here. Somebody's going to, you're going to meet the yin to your yang, Cancer. Your person's coming in. Your person, the one, is coming in is what I'm feeling. Cancers, and with this Two of Staffs, fire sign energy could be dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag. This is you being at a crossroads. Maybe you were thinking you were um, not going to make a decision here in love. You've re removed somebody from the past that was no longer serving you, maybe not treating you right, taking you for granted. You're at a crossroads here. I'm just going to play the field. Mm -mm. Somebody's coming to lock you down. Yeah. You were thinking you were going to play the field here because you were very guarded. Somebody's about to come and take that. Mm -mm. Somebody's coming to lock you down with that king of coins, queen of coins energy. Cancers. Let's get it together. Hold on. Didn't have a plan. It wasn't supposed to be this good already. Cancers with this King of Cups. <laughs> More of your energy here. This is you being very flirtatious or this other person. I feel like this is the energy of you having many options because you're dating. You were keeping it casual here, keeping it light, keeping it fun. And then this other person's going to come in. Keep in mind, this is another king here. So a major player. Major players here in these options. Cancer. You have the Four of Wands. This is the marriage card to me. So while some of you are not necessarily going to run off and get married to this person, this is setting the foundation in new passions. So you're going to be dating, flirting, and this person's going to be coming around. You're going to be spending a good time with them, and they're going to want to lock you down. Cancer, cancer. You have many options. And I feel like you know that some of these suitors are good with the Seven of Cups energy and this Two of Staffs. And maybe you're hesitating to make this choice because maybe there's more than one person who's a good fit. Okay, maybe it's an earth sign and a water sign person. Let me know down in the comments. But your person is coming. Cancers. The lovers. Gemini energy here. Some Your person is coming in this season. So whether it be summer or June, your person is coming in. You've released some things in the past. You are completely not being held back here. Okay, Cancers? Not being held back. Real love is coming your way. Good morning, Carter Bear. I'm in the middle of a meeting. Can you give me a few minutes? You want to read with me? Come on. Auntie Kayla's a Cancer. We're going to do this really quick, okay? Cancers. Capricorn and Virgo energy here in the building. Young Carter. Cap <laughs> Cancers, you have the Wheel of Fortune, okay? The universe has stepped in. It is guiding you to release things that are no longer serving you. You are going to be in a season of happiness here with this Wheel of Fortune. Removing things out. Closing out cycles. And that's when this person is going to be brought in. Cancers, you have the Six of Swords. Could be dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But this card, want to see it? Mm -hmm. This card symbolizing walking away to calmer waters. What I'm getting here, Cancers, is that maybe even silent treatment just had to walk away from a situation quietly. Because maybe... Maybe you walked away from somebody who was flirtatious here in the past and you just couldn't get past these communication issues or them doing a little too much here in the DMs. You walked away from that. And that's that energy you released to bring this person in. What's underneath this four of steps? Two fours here. Foundations, balance being, setting that foundation to have a nice, ba good balance here in this relationship. Here's the four of swords. More air sign energy here. This is sitting on something. Waiting to make a move here. Sitting on some information. I feel like cancers, you know, you know something about this person that's coming in. I feel like you already know who this person is, this king of coins, this, um, that's coming in the yin to your yang. You know who this person is. you feel, you feel it in your gut. Your intuition is leading you to this person. You're just nervous about making that decision underneath this lovers. 
the high priestess secrets. Maybe you've been, maybe this person has been watching you, your social media. Maybe you've been checking out their social media. Maybe both of you know things about each other that you don't want the other person to know that you've been looking into them. But secrets here, the, you guys are doing some research on each other is what I'm, what I'm getting here. Feeling each other out there. Underneath this wheel of fortune, the full new beginnings. This is the first of the... This is the start of a brand new journey with the major arcana here, okay? This is you. Maybe you were backed in a corner and had to, having to leave a situation here in the in, in the past. Yep, yeah, give it just a second. But this you're not going to be a fool anymore. And this person's not coming in to treat you like a fool, but they want a fresh start with you. I feel like this is them being guarded, being vulnerable with that. Being guarded and struggling to be vulnerable, excuse me, with this nine of staffs energy at the bottom. So you have the staff and the cup here, fire and water. They want to offer themselves, they want to extend themselves, they, they want to be passionate with you and vulnerable, but are you going to also meet them halfway? Cancers, what's underneath this nine of staffs? You're doing really great, Carter, by the way. Is the ten of staffs in reverse. So what you thought was done, maybe you thought you weren't going to find love this quickly. Cancers, you are. You're closing out the cycle with new passions. You thought you were walking away, not going to... Um, commit yourself to something. You were going to be single here. No. Somebody's coming in to lock you down. And with this Hierophant energy, this is the married woman card to me. This is um, going to the courthouse and making something official. Somebody is coming to lock you down. Is it a Taurus person? Taurus with the king of coins. Taurus here. Cancers. Are you dealing with an earth sign? Cancers, this is you with the Queen of Cups. Using your intuition, having hope, keeping the faith here, getting messages, okay? This is you having the faith that you could meet the one, that the right person could come into you, and now you've gotten it. Now you've gotten it, and you're nervous about this person coming in. More earth sign energy here with this four of pentacles. You're nervous about this person coming in. So what I feel like, Cancers, is you haven't even told anybody about this person. You're keeping it close to your chest because you don't want anything to ruin it. You don't want to jinx this opportunity with this person. Give me one second, baby hands. You don't want to ruin this with this opportunity. You don't want to ruin this opportunity by jinxing it, talking about it too soon. Reaffirmed here with the Page of Swords, more air sign energy here. You're not letting anybody know about this brand new opportunity. Page, new opportunity. And with this Emperor energy here, we're going to leave it here. Your divine masculine or divine feminine, the one, your other half is coming in. This king and queen of coins here at the top, it upright and reverse, the yin to your yang, coming in, baby. Somebody's coming to lock you down, cancers. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for my almost daily tarot uploads. Find me on IG. That, in that information is in the description box. And keep it real, water sign family. Love is coming your way. Ooh.